Okay, doing a little uh, quick review how to um, strip down or field strip in a little Ostra Cub. They come in 22, 22 short, 25 auto. This is the 22 short version. Um, this has been in my family uh, since before I was born. But anyway, it's not many people have shown how to take it apart, so I thought I'd show you in case you have one and want to clean it. You'll see this right here. Of course, it holds it back like a 1911. If you put it up, it'll click back, hold back um, when you put the safety up. And this is how you take it apart, pretty much. You push it back, just like that. Here's the secret. This is the key. The barrel is pretty much the key to the whole operation. Then you let this go. And it slides forward, and there you go. You're pretty much all taken apart. Ready to be cleaned. You can take that out. Clean it there. That's where the fire pin is. I recommend you check around the barrel for any uh, damages, because after a while they start to make a little divot. And um, they just will start uh, giving you problems. Plus, I recommend you shoot a pretty good 22 short. Weak ones can hardly pull back the spring. The spring in here is pretty stout for a 22 short, so it takes a pretty good bullet. Okay, I'm going to show you how to put her back together, pretty much all the parts. Put that like this. Get this part in there. Pretty much slides together pretty easy. Put the safety back up, lock it back, and grab your little key here. You see which way I got the ribs pointing, pointing, pointing downhill. Just work it in, work it up, twist it, and lock it into place. It's done. I don't like to let it slam fire in these because, as you've seen with that barrel. It's a rim fire, so it'll just start making a divot in the barrel, just dry firing it all the time. Um, these are ones you don't want to play with like that. Anyways, it's a little review on the Ostra Cub. Good little pistols. Um, with that little barrel like that, makes it seem like they're a big boy. Got a little floating barrel, just like a 1911. Got a real hammer, which I like the the hammer instead of hammerless. Sometimes I know it ain't as good for uh, packing. Um, anyways, that's a little Asher Cub. Um, hope to be putting it on uh, paper here soon. So I'm gonna take it out and do a little shooting, a little reviewing on it. Show you how it shoots, operates, and all that fun stuff. Anyways, thanks for watching.